here it is. Why don't you just do it? Trust me, it's an easier way out than whatever asinine plan your friend came up with. Oh, what? How, how stupid does she think we are? You made it through, well done. Okay, follow me. We've still got work to do. At least she can't touch us back here. What's happening? Um, hmm, okay. Okay, d uh, don't move. Okay, all right, so, I've got an idea, but it is bloody dangerous. Here we go. Ah! Oh, for God's they told me that if I ever turned this flashlight on, I would die. They told me that about everything. I mean, I don't even know why they bothered giving me this stuff if they didn't want me to use it. It's pointless. Man. Ooh. It's dark down here, isn't it? They say that the old caretaker of this place went absolutely crazy. Chopped up his entire staff of robots. All of them robots. They say at night you can still hear the screams of their replicas. All of them functionally indistinguishable from the originals. No memory of the incident. Nobody knows what they're screaming about. Absolutely terrifying. Though obviously not paranormal in any meaningful way. Let's keep moving. The factory entrance must be around here somewhere. Careful, careful. Wait, careful. Let me light this jump for you. This looks dangerous. I'll hold the light steady. Oh, nicely done. Quick, this way. Here's an interesting story, you might like this. I almost got a job down here in manufacturing. But uh, guess who the foreman went with? Only an exact duplicate of himself, nepotism. Ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the smelly humans. The, the, um, sorry, that's, no, I wouldn't say smelly. Just, just tending to the humans. Sorry about that, that just, that just slipped out. I'm a bit insensitive. The smelly humans. Okay, we have to split up here for a moment. Portal up to that passage, and I'll see you on the other side. out of that room. Can you reach that wall back there? Okay, 
there's another wall over here. Oh, I'll tell you. Humans? Oh, love them. Just the way they look. It's great. And their folklore. Wonderful. They're very colourful. I'm going to take this rail down the back way. See you at the bottom. Good luck. Turret redemption lines active. Please do not engage with turrets heading towards redemption. Turret redemption lines are not rise. Please exit the turret redemption line. Follow me, you're gonna love this. Almost there. Ta da! Only the turret control center. Thank you very much. Here, come have a look out the window. It's good. See that scanner out there, right? It's deciding which turrets to keep and which to toss, and it's using that master turret there as a template. Now, if, if we pull out the template turret, it'll shut down the whole production line. Right, um, hmm. I'm gonna have to hack the door so that we can get at it. Technical. Um, you'll need to turn around while I do. Hello. Turn around. I'll only be a second, if you wouldn't mind. Done. Hands. Okay, go on. Just pull that turret out. Response. Well, that should do it. Template missing. Continuing from memory. Oh, it hasn't done it. 
Oh, yes. What what do you have there? Hello. 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 What what are you? Oh, brilliant! It's for that's brilliant. New template accepted. If we're lucky, she won't find out all her turrets are crap until it's too late. <laughs> Classic. Okay, keep your eye on the turret line. I'm gonna go and hack the door open. Template. Okay, I'm about to start hacking. It's a little bit more complicated than it looked from your side. It should take about ten minutes. Keep one eye on the door. This door's actually pretty complicated. No. Oh. How long's the door been open? I mean, was there any sort of announcement before it opened? Like a, like a buzzer or an alarm of some kind? Or like a hacker alert? I mean, yeah, fair enough. The important thing is it's open. But it's, in, it's just mentioned in the future. Cough or something. All right, now, she can't use her turrets. So let's go and take care of that neurotoxin generator as well. Bring your daughter to work day. That did not end well. And 40 potato batteries. Embarrassing. I mean, I realise they're children, but still, you know, low-hanging fruit and all that. Barely science, really, is it? Baking soda volcano. Well, you know, at least it's not a potato battery, I'll give it that, but it's not terrifically original, is it? You know what I mean? Not exactly primary research, even within the child sciences. I'm guessing this wasn't one of the scientists' children. You know, I don't want to be snobby, but let's be honest, it's got it's got manual labourer written all over it, hasn't it? I'm not saying they're not as good as the professionals, you know, they're just they're just a lot dumber. Look at that, it's growing right up into the ceiling. The whole place is probably overrun with potatoes at this point, isn't it? At least you won't starve, though. I'm pretty sure we're going the right way, just to reassure you. Don't worry, I'm absolutely guaranteeing you 100% that it's this way. No, it's not this way. Okay, let's try this way. 